if you've ever I mean it's not the ugliest one in the world but I would say second ugliest so my mom has this like um, I don't know obsession with like ugly tablecloths the uglier it is the more she wants to pay for it so that's fine I just I'm con conforming to it let's cover it with our food see the food even the food looks better even though it's in this plastic plate that we got when we were supposed to be moving um, she got these as like spare plates because all our china and like whatever the fuck I don't even know uh, was packed in boxes named fragile taped up in a storage that was paid for separately from our home very expensive by the way because it was like impossible to get a storage at the time uh, and so we're like we're just gonna eat out of these little plates it's a little sack and then uh, that was like years ago so that happened yeah I don't live with crazy people though don't worry it's just it just seems that way and so this oatmeal is actually really good despite the way it looks also made by my wonderful mother who um also got these wonderful vanilla cookies that I asked her for. I just thought I'd share that with you guys. Because <laughs> today is a beautiful Sunday and I'm not going to work. It is, um, you know, the, the Sabbath. We're celebrating the Sabbath. I'm pretty sure there's a reason God told us not to work on this day. I think he, like, had meant for us to, like, love each other or something. But, nah, we love you. Mm, my god, you guys. I wish you guys knew how good this oatmeal was, though. I know it looks disgusting. It looks like the stuff in the Matrix. When you, um, you know, they're eating porridge or something, and it's, like, gloppy and gray. But this is, like... Oh, I can't even break it. Mm-hmm. There you go. Mm-hmm-hmm. Hey, this stuff, not a bad idea.